Ah, well, as much as I don't really care for spring cleaning, I sure am glad I'm getting it out of the way sooner rather than later. This place can get pretty messy if I'm not too careful. And hey, thanks for helping me out, guys. You rock! No problem, Sonic. After all, you helped me clean out my lab a few weeks ago, so I'm returning the favor, you know? Oh, right. What about you, Knuckles? You sure you shouldn't be helping SBO and Vector stop criminals or something? Or, in recent cases, giving out dating advice? Yeah, what was that all about anyway? Nah, that business was a bust. Oh, what a surprise. As for the criminal part, though, unfortunately things have been pretty slow lately. Isn't that a good thing, though? Oh, yeah, don't get me wrong. It's not like we want something bad to happen just so we can be on top of it. But it does have us pretty bored lately. We haven't even had an outside client for a few weeks. Geez, sounds pretty rough. We've basically been living paycheck to paycheck. It isn't all that bad, but hopefully things go all right on Vector's end tomorrow. What, is he starting some new get-rich-quick business again? What came before the dating advice service again? Oh, wasn't it the one where he tried selling ice over the internet? No, he's trying to stop doing stuff like that. But regardless, he's gonna see if he can get us a better deal with the city and everything. We might not be the busiest with criminals right now, but we bust our butts whenever there's a case. Hopefully it all works out. Yeah. Oh, hey, so that's where I buried this thing, huh? I wonder if I should keep it or not. You'd really just throw something like that away? I don't really have a reason to keep it. Maybe not right now, but it did help you out back when you had to fight that weird robot. Yeah, that freak knight thing that tried to make a move on Amy. Plus, he's the one that gave me this thing in the first place. I don't want a reminder of that just hanging around here. Into the trash it goes. Robo, have you set the stage for this little competition? Are they both ready? Yes, sir. Just taking this over to the returning side and we'll be all set. Perfect. Proceed as planned. All right, let's get this show on the road. What? Lord Robotnik! Yeah, what is it? Excuse me, but why have you reactivated me? Oh, that. Well, I've decided to turn my sights from that hedgehog to the city itself in the form of planning a takeover of Station Square and I need the right creation of mine for the job. It's very likely that you're just another failure of mine. But, having the heart of gold that I do, I decided I'd boot you up once more and give you one last chance to prove your potential to me. My potential? I see, my lord. And how shall I go about proving this to you? Shall I attempt to ensnare that hedgehog once more? Bah! You had your chance at that! And I don't think I need to remind you of how that went! Besides, I just said that I'm shifting focus. But my lord, it, it wasn't my fault! I had become infatuated with that... With that angelic seraph of a girl. Oh, how my metaphorical heart nearly burst at the seams when I had first laid my unworthy eyes upon that beautiful Amy Rose. You know, for the longest time I didn't believe in love at first sight, but I think you've changed that idea for me. Don't you dare encourage him! And don't make excuses, you failure! But my lord, I served you loyally and I- You're on thin ice as it is! And if I were you, I wouldn't throw my one chant at redemption out the window just yet! You hear me? I see, Master Robotnik. How shall I prove my worth to you? I was getting there. Zerato, come forth! At your service. Zerato? That's my name. Zerato here started out as the second of the Nightmare series of robots. The same as you, Zalvandor. But once you disappointed me, I decided to scrap that plan and go from the ground up yet again. And the result is a humanoid-framed robot that doesn't even require chaos energy to be powerful. Oh please, Master Robotnik, you flatter me. Your genius made me what I am, and I will serve you dutifully, without a second thought. Unlike that garbage over there. Is what I heard right? You failed your mission to marry some girl? Some girl?! Bite thy tongue, fellow! Pardon me, but if you saw this beauty in person, your heart would be stolen as well. Where did you get that? <laughs> That's the girl you fell for? I thought since there was such a big deal made about it, she would at least be good looking. How dare you! Master Robotnik approved of our matrimony! He even administered the wedding himself! Oh, some wedding it was, Zalvandor! You didn't even have any rings or vows! I may have approved it, but it was all just a setup to lure Sonic there and defeat him once and for all anyway! And you couldn't even get that right! I was all set to have your wedding cake and eat it too, but that isn't really enjoyable when the groom is a pile of scrap on the ground, now is it? Regardless, I shall not let you badmouth her like you are doing. I shall protect the maiden Amy's honor to my death! This is where I come in, right? It's funny you should mention that. 
The way you'll prove your worth and potential is in a fight between the newly created Zerato. If you can hold your own, you may stay on as one of my henchmen and aid me in my mission. I see. And if I happen to lose? You'll be thrown away. Simple as that. Are you two ready? Let's get this over with. Aye. If that is what you wish, Master Robotnik, I shall demonstrate my worth! Begin! Is that the best you've got? Nay, just getting warmed up. Oh, please. Enough of that. Looks like it's over. Not just yet. You're about to see something truly spiffy. What? <laughs> you see? That's how it's done. By a landslide, the winner is Zerato! I think we both saw that one coming, Master Robotnik. Certainly. Zalvindor! Your Highness, I beg you! You've disappointed me for the last time. Robo, throw him out with the garbage. Immediately. But I- Shut it! Come, Zerato, let's discuss the plan for tomorrow. Well, that's taken care of. Aw, oh, who would throw a perfectly good instrument like this away? Master... Robotnik... Master... No... Eggman... It's just... I don't know. I think she likes me, but she said she just wanted to stay friends for right now. I don't know if I should make any advances, or just let things be, or what, you know? Man, girls are confusing. Why do people come to me about these things? Oh, it's open! I just wish there was some easy solution. Hey guys, what's up? Silver's telling us about his relationship problems at the moment. Ugh, are you still on that? Yes, I am still on that. What do you got there? The reason I came over. This was on my door when I got back from throwing everything away. Here, take a look. Good day, Sonic. I am leaving this to forewarn you of an incident that will take place tomorrow in front of City Hall. To prevent it, be present between noon and one o'clock. Signed, and there's no signature. I wonder who left it. Dunno. It kinda sounds like someone might just be messing with you. I'm sorry, are we just going to forget what I was talking about? My love life is in shambles, people. Silver, this is important. And my love life isn't? So are you going to be there tomorrow? I think I've gotta. I mean, even if it turns out to be a hoax, I shouldn't take the chance. After all, we all know who it could end up being. True. Hey, maybe this was left by someone who caught wind of something he's planning. Well, either way, I'll find out tomorrow. You want anyone there for backup? Nah, I'm pretty sure I'll be able to handle it. Whatever it is. Just keep me connected, as always. If something happens, just let me know. Will do. Alright, I'll catch you guys later. This may be a crazy idea, but let's say I show up to her place on a white horse. <sighs> yeah. Anything yet? Nope. City Hall's just as boring as always. I'll let you know if that changes, though. Hmm, well, looks like this all really was just a ah, hoax. what do we have here? What? Seems the foil has shown up earlier than expected. Robotnik. Tch, that figures. And you must be the famous Sonic the Hedgehog I've heard so much about. I'd love to chat with you, but if you could please move aside, I've got a business matter to attend to in City Hall. <laughs> excuse me? And what exactly would that be? I have a mission to complete. While you aren't directly involved with it, I have been given orders to trample you, or anyone really, who gets in my way. Will you step aside, or will I have to carry out that order? Not so fast! What the- Zalvindor? You? 
Can things stop dropping out of the sky? My, so you're still puttering around? Haven't kicked the bucket just yet? How nice of you to show hither, Sonic. I see you received my memo. So that's where that came from, huh? So what, did you two lure me here to team up on me for Eggman or something? Nay, I am no longer affiliated with the Doctor. He disowned me for this new model you see before you, called Zorato. He's never gonna give something a normal name, is he? His hope for me half broken, and along with it my loyalty. And now in the remains of that Shattered Allegiance lies my score to settle with his new pawn! Hence the note I left on your dwelling. Oh, I see. You want me to take him out for you? Sorry, but I don't really want to do a favor for anyone who tried stealing and marrying my girlfriend. I realize you harbor resentment for me, and I you. While I am not completely in favor of uniting with you, I do know firsthand that this new model has great strength, and that I cannot defeat him unaccompanied. You are the only one in my database that I believe can successfully unite with me to destroy him. And if that is not sufficient for you, he is intending on attacking your beloved city's main building of operations. Eggman's plan to take over, it would seem. It's Master Robotnik, you filthy traitor. Master Robotnik, cowardly leader. Identical, really. That the mission you were talking about? You're not as stupid as you look. Oh, that does it. Also, he said Amy is not beautiful. Oh, that really does it. Tails, you read me? Loud or clear? Some new Eggman robot showed up and is attempting to get into City Hall. And not only that, but Zalvandor's back too. You know, that robot that tried marrying Amy. You're never going to let that go, are you? What? Really? But it turns out he wants this thing done for just as much as we do. Looks like the fight's about to break out. Talk to you soon, buddy. Alright, Sally Caliber, looks like we're working together on this one, but this is a one-time thing, you hear me? Blaring and fair. I don't have all day. There's a city hall that needs to be overthrown. Hurry this up if you can. You heard him. Let's give him what he wants! Sonic win! You sure don't seem that tough! Call this a warm -up. Could use some help here! Axis Lightning! That was a cheap shot, man! My apologies, that is not what I intended. Oh, come on, really? You saw how close I was to him, you just wanted to hit me! It was not my intention, although perhaps you needed to be taken down a peg. Oh man, Golden Boy, you sure haven't changed. Likewise, you're as cocky as ever. This isn't over! Ugh. Perhaps it'd be in your best interest to save the squabbling for after the fight. Or not. It makes my job easier if you two are distracted by your own banner. Ugh, he's right, you know. Aye, we must set our differences aside for the time being. You know, this sounds cliché to say, and I really don't want to sound cliché, but I thought you two would be stronger than this. That's a shame. Don't give me that! You're going down! <laughs> Hello, Chaotix Detective Agency. Knuckles? Are you all there? Uh, Vector was just about to leave, but... There's something happening right now that you guys might be interested in. It's Tails. I'll put him on speaker. Tails, buddy, what's up? One of Eggman's machines is trying to get into City Hall and take over the city. What? You serious? Yeah. Sonic's fighting with it right now, but Knuckles told me you were trying to get a better deal with the city. I'm sure if you showed some evidence that Eggman is behind all of this, like, oh, I don't know, a destroyed robot, that wouldn't be a problem. Aw, oh, Tails, you're a lifesaver. Come on, boys, let's get a move on. This could mean big money for us. Hello? Ha! Nexus Lightning! Well, there's no denying you had potential to be great. Cease your yammering! But you're outdated and well past your prime. Just give up and take your place in the junkyard! What's he doing? Let's take you down a peg. Pathetic. You already lost me before. You really think getting help from a former enemy would truly help you? You son of a- I... I have failed. This was fun while it lasted, but now you get what you had coming. Just remember, Zalvador, 
You've brought this upon yourself! What? Sonic! Oh, looky here. Decided to keep being the hero that saves the day, Hedgehog? <laughs> Just shut up already! Yo, B-Boy! What the- what are you guys doing here? We'll explain later. You try to destroy that thing, right? Another one of Eggman's pawns? Y yeah how do you know, Tails? Oh. We thought you could use these to finish him off. What? Where did those come from? Oh, so you actually stopped by his place before coming here, huh? Are you gonna use them or not? <laughs> well, he powered up earlier, so I guess it's only fair that I do the same. Let's do this! <laughs> So that's Super Sonic. Damn! You went through that thing like it was nothing! Whoa! Sonic! Sonic. Hey, you okay? Uh, I just got so fatigued for a second there. Don't remember that happening when I'd used the emeralds before. Maybe it's because you haven't used all seven like that in quite some time. That was quite a splendid show of power, Sonic. Perhaps I've underestimated what you are truly capable of. Salvador. Well, I guess this will be enough evidence that one of Robotnik's robots was here trying to attack the city. It's got his logo and copyright info on the bottom. Original Robotnik creation. Donut steel. What does that even mean? Even so, he relocated to a new place of operations some time ago. We can't arrest him if we don't know his whereabouts. I can provide you with that information. Huh? But aren't you one of his robots too? Why exactly would you do that for us? Ah, that old bastard disowned me. Truth be told, I care not what happens to him now. In fact, the thought of him jailed and unable to produce any of his precious inventions is one that gives me joy. Well, that works out perfectly. Sonic, know that this is anything but over. The score between us still must be settled. And next time, it shall be settled for good. I was thinking the same thing. Don't go getting the wrong idea. Just because we worked together this one time doesn't mean I like you any more than I did before. When the next time comes, you're going down, Sally Caliber. Likewise. Until we meet again, Sonic. Come, green one, purple one. I shall give you the coordinates to where that coward is hiding. Ugh, what's up? I just... Man, the emeralds really took a toll on me this time. I wonder what that's all about. Well, it has been a long time since you've gone full super, hasn't it? Maybe it's just like a muscle you need to stay on top of training or something. The moment I used their energy to go super, it felt like a huge weight pressing down on me. I wouldn't worry about it too much, bro. The emeralds work in mysterious ways sometimes, take it from me. Yeah, you might be right. After all, it's probably nothing. You really think Zerato was a good name for that robot? Hey, lay off! It sounds cool, doesn't it? Freeze, Robotnik! We have a warrant for your arrest issued by the city of Station Square. Yeah, yeah. So anyway, I... WHAT?! We went to the city with evidence that you were trying to take it over. Turns out Sonic's wrist device was recording the whole exchange he had with your little toy. That made it pretty easy. But... 
how did you find me? Oh yeah, that reminds me. Zalvandor says hi. Z Zalvandor? Oh, that worthless traitor! Are we going to do this the easy way or the hard way? Your choice, Doctor. Robo, get them now! Aye, aye, sir. <laughs> Hard way it is. That's fine. It's really just more fun for us, anyway. All right, old man. You're coming with us. No, you can't take me. This isn't fair. L long live the Eggman Empire. Eggman Empire? Yeah, right.